Hi, it's me, Papa John the Tool Man. Uh, today what I want to talk about is on the Easy RJ45 and, and uh, running PoE over your Cat5 or Cat6. Uh, there can be, and rightly so, some concerns sometimes of PoE and the front ends shorting out. And if that's a concern, uh, maybe because of the uh, design of your ports on your hardware being totally tight, uh, the back wall, zero play between the front end of the connector, uh, or if you feel your tool is not crimping totally nice and clean and flush, and you got to get the job done, uh, you know, there is a solution. So I want to show you what you can do to make sure that there is no problem uh, running PoE on your Cat5 or Cat6. Okay, before we cut these extended conductors off using my flush cutter, Let's make sure that your cable is all the way up in there because we want it tight up in there, ready to go. Now I'm going to cut as flush as I can. The nose of the locking tab prevents you from being totally flush, but as you'll see right here, we can get it pretty, pretty flush, but they are protruding, they're sticking out. So now what you want to do is just come in and pull back right there and then take your easy tool crimp tool and of course the blade's not going to be doing anything because they're not sticking out and then when you insert it captivate it crimp it and there you go totally nice clean flush cut easy rj45 for those who are concerned about their poe application thanks